G-Town oh, Tom. No. G-Town Tom wasn't even staff of this event. He helped me with seeding for this. He stayed up overnight from 1.30 a.m. to 9 a.m. several days in a row to get the seeding down. Oh, definitely. Like, legend. All right. But we are but getting grand finals, baby. game one of grand finals. We got Link versus Marth. Yeah, I'm very interested to see what kind of changes. Oh. Oh. Just raw. That's a huge change. The no jumper. I mean, I, I really do think that Marth probably wins this matchup, but I think that Link just really makes it difficult at times. Mm -hmm. I mean, like having the projectiles there in neutral totally changes the way that Marth's going to play neutral, right? This is a completely oh, wow. different scene <laughs> from Riptide. He's Pack it completely up. Completely okay. suffocating Aklo. Pack it up, put it away. Do you remember what tier you are, my friend? Yeah. That's what that's what Zane's saying right yeah. now. Also, the, the set count for them is 0 and 4 in Zane's favor for 2024. Closest I mean, that Aklo got was at Riptide. Whoa. He's been practicing that setup so much. He's been loving the down air into instant up B and edge canceling it on Yoshi platforms. I was watching him just beat up a fox for a few hours, uh, and that was the setup he was riding out. Also getting the power shield on the boomerang. I know it's like a small thing, but just like so locked into what Aklo's going to be doing. Like He's prepared. He's definitely practiced this matchup. I like how he's playing very in Aklo's face and not even giving him the opportunity to pull out uh, projectiles. Yeah. Right. Like, getting the bomb in hand is so important, and not allowing him to do so. And if there is a man swinging a sword in your face, you cannot pull a bomb. No. Oh, great oh. tech. Oh. Oh. oh, oh, oh. OK, OK. Almost kept it going. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's kind of like, OK. They're both just edge canceling dare. Who can yeah. edge cancel dare the better one? Up top. There oh, he is. edge canceled That's what I'm off talking the about. B landing. Zane's on another level right now. Edge canceling everything. I like how he, he held shield expecting uh, the second hit of forward smash. Oh, God. This so Aklo had a boomerang coming back on the back. Oh, crazy. my lord. Even with the grapple coming out, Zane still had an answer. Yeah, we don't get to like, talk about the boomerang. No. Nope. <laughs> he's just putting a note on it. At Egg Dog, Zane told Aklo, stop going Link against me. I think he might mean it. I mean, the, the Yoshi's pick, I think, was the right one. Like, not allowing him the space to do much of anything. Uh, Dreamland here. Wow, just stuffing out the approach immaculately here, and we're going right into the strings. Yep. This is a funeral. Yeah. It doesn't matter what character you are, Zane is still going to zero to death you. He's just that's, that much better. That's what we're seeing right now. Yo. <laughs> and this is like, Aklo is probably in the running for top five in the world, and Zane is dismantling him this hard. I think it's just a statement of how good Zane is at the game. He's tech chasing off back throws. Yeah. Oh, God. It just don't matter, I feel like. It, it, it's very interesting watching, like, just how far the gap can be sometimes. Yeah, because Aklo's been playing amazing throughout this entire tournament, right? Just beat Hungry Box. Beautiful, though. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Went for the mix on the, uh, the Marth Killer. He knew it wasn't close enough, so he said, I'll soak the hit. Get the shine out of shield. Call it a day. I think it can also be tough to, like, get things started versus Zane, right? To, like, get your momentum, because his combo game is just so heavy. Mm -hmm. His Where wall, too, is nuts. Yeah. And it's very hard to combo him. Like, he got an up to there and let nothing. He got jabbed, Zane imme uh, immediately PI'd out and shielded. Like, it's so hard to get a combo started on him. Ooh. Oh! The I like that. The full charge. What do we get here, though? Ah. Uh, twinkle toes. He's playing possum. OK. And there you go. Okay. Push out a little Aklo bit. with the happen. lead. Yeah. There's some life. There's some life. Yeah. We are talking about getting packed up right here, but I mean, I getting like a Dreamline game is going to be nice. And I, we might see the Link come back out on FD. I mean, just avoiding the chain grab, but mm -hmm. I, I feel like after that game one, it might not even be a question. Mm -hmm. We'll see. I like that they try to cover the side beat at top platform. And He's been loving the edge cancels on that. He tried again. Mm -hmm. Tries to get, like, the craziest angle into full drift in to grab ledge, but... Not I, quite close oh, enough. I think it's also crazy that Zane can just start experimenting with moves in grand finals of a major. That only happens when he's feeling himself. Yeah. Well, I, I feel like he's been in the lab mixing and matching the potions, but this is the first time the public gets to see it. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. Golly. It's perfection. Gee. I was watching Zane versus level one Marth before the, the matches happened, and it feels like the same thing is happening to Aklo. Yeah. A top five player, a top ten player. I just feel like when Zane. your execution is here, it don't matter. Yeah, just get down. Yeah, there. I love the forward air because you can't you can't tech it. It's so good. Like yeah. low percent. You know, you think about like down air or like ribbon and F smash or getting the down tilt. They might be able to do like wall tech, air dodge to stage, get oh. an extra, extra layer of recovery in. But, but then the forward air covers underneath you and you can't tech it. Yeah. And you're invincible because you just grab the ledge. Yeah. Like that's so genious. Full denial. 
Okay. The hero of time, people are cheering and yelling. I mean, we talked about how it might be the best chance, but man, this has been. It's looking rough. He has been being outright dismantled. We're finally getting some of the Fuse hitbox shenanigans that he's been working on quite a lot. Um, oh. Doing that Z drop as he runs towards you. Oh, oh, oh. Zane just calling himself. Yeah. Oh, the boomerang helped. Extending. Oh! oh. The, the <laughs> crossbow training. Oh, baby, it's Legolas. I mean, the arrow is like. <laughs> is he just dead? Uh, Zane looking like Star okay, no, right we, now. We can bomb jump, but even then. He sees everything. Oh, God, this list looks so difficult. Yeah. Just the amount of games and stocks. Uh, and and okay. Zane's so good at power shielding all these kind of. Random projectiles. Yeah, it's like, and also how you feel like you just landed a monster zero to death, and it's like, yeah, I'm feeling myself, and then you can't even finish the thought, and no. Zane just does that. Exactly. I don't think he gets that either. Uh, yeah, just again. Oh my. Second Lord. burst, same as the first. Oh god. A whole lot louder and a whole lot worse, man. <laughs> this is. I mean, it's I jumped over the grab too. So smart. Okay. Not even gonna get the extension there with the up smash. Yeah. I feel like there's so many little fakies that he's gotta get through here. Tries to oh. do the bomb oh. stuff. Okay. Hello. Okay. Okay. All right, all right. Signs of life for Maclo, signs Kinda of life. Sick. Setting up some bomb traps. Yeah. Oh my god, and he just spot out just through the entire invincibility. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right he really likes that. He, I, it just it forces good. a ledge situation. On yeah, you. that's what it looks like. It's like you have to work from the corner now. And there's not much else that you can get off of uh, grab with down air. Oh, oh. And Zane has been so good at edge guarding Link. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like even off the grapple timings, off like the bomb recovery, Zane is just ready. He's also been fantastic at dealing with projectiles. Uh, he like, jabbed one of the boomerangs. He's power shielding bombs back. Mm -hmm. He's just running forward at Aklo. Oh. Great oh, attack, great detected. The air dodge actually somehow working out in Zane's favor there yeah. to continue the Ooh. pressure. I also like how he's dealing with the, the walls where uh, Aklo is doing a full hop and then Z drop the bomb. Right. And instead of Zane like jumping into it and dying or getting hit into a, a downer, he just does nothing. He just oh. waits because it doesn't threaten him at all. Yo, does Boomerang catch preclude you from grabbing ledge or is he just too low? Because the, the Boomerang catch has an animation, right? right. Like you you yeah. get stuck in standing sometimes. I don't know if you're in the air and you do boomerang catch if it stops you from having your ledge grab box out. If I, it does, that's sick. Yeah. <laughs> in a bad way. Right in like now. a terminally oh. ill way. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> in like yeah. a, Not in a an unhealthy way. big C way. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Charging yeah. that F smash is going to lead to a little bit more knockback. That might cost him. Oh my god. Oh. Zane one stock away. The crowd's coming alive for Aklo, They're but... They're trying. I mean, you got to coax some life back into this grand. It's a it's basically tough. even game, and yeah. it, it feels like Zane is destroying him. Yeah. That's it's the, it's the spirit of the set. Yeah. 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 Aklo needs a huge combo right now. He yeah. can still do it. I mean, playing the patient possible. game. Raining bombs from above. Yeah. Oh. Like super sudden death. That's not how it starts. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's not how it's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, now he's keeping uh, keeping Zane away. I think for the first time this oh. set. Yeah, actually getting enough space. I mean, Zane doesn't feel the the impetus to approach. I think oh, he's found God. his opening. Oh. Zane's uh -oh. gonna do oh. it. That's oh wait. See? Even with the head bonk. Ah. Wait, he's waiting for the spot dodges every time too. Oh, okay. wait a minute. Wait a second. Yeah. A B. I, I was right there with that. Was, I, thought I, really I thought he was going to down it. I really thought he was just going to rip it. Okay. It's Bomb hits done. You can't build up too much more percent because you can get sent off the top here now. Oh, good wiggle ah. out. Good wiggle oh, out. Oh, oh, drop. He's still going. There's a chance. Hang on. There's a Whoa. world. Oh, you slow get him. Oh, dear God. He's not even shield dropping. <sighs> These tournament winners. Finish. I know. Tournament winners in all the sets and all the characters. He's doing like the, the sneakiest jump on, like that and one. But he finally just rips the F smash. Like he had been doing that the past two stocks to just like catch Zane off. He had that like uh, that grab in the corner off that. And Zane finally just slams the C stick, takes the tournament, 2024 wavelength. Just had so much presence that entire set. Like complete 180 from Riptide. That yeah. did not look close. No. Zane is the best player in the world. Zane also now at 16 all-time major wins, tying Ken oh for all-time major wins Whoa. with Solo Marth, reaching Marth levels that we've never seen before. He's going to be the GOAT one day. Yeah.
I mean, he's Looking. up for consideration. I mean, Brandon always says it. We got to start talking about the GOAT conversation with Zane in it. Yeah. It's looking like another year. Beautiful insane. stuff. What an insane run. This was a – like, he was basically – like, not like a locked in, but he had a very good chance at number one. Yeah. This was a victory lap for him. I would say mm -hmm, so. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've got Don't Park and really uh, – we've got Let's Make Moves Miami, but I'm not sure if he's attending that. And then Nouns Vitational. Uh, Nouns Flat Vitational Fight. And Plat Fight as well. We've the Function few. 4. Oh, true say. We've got a, a lot of tournaments in the year left. Uh, which is crazy awesome to see. Yeah, oh, honestly, I feel like we. Uh, There's a lull sometimes yeah. in the winter seasons. Like I remember that one year when there was a, there was nothing after main stage. Yeah, uh, nothing like crazy up until the match, but. This year, there's a lot, and I, I really like that. There's a lot. There's a, there's a lot of presence right now in the melee scene. Mm -hmm. It's great. Yeah, good stuff. Can always use more tournaments. <laughs> it can't hurt, man. No, it really it can't. Really can. Uh, I oh, think we are. Trying to finagle a winner's yeah. interview, so maybe we. I'll, I can we, hop off. You want to hop off? Yep. All right, here, I'll take the headset. It was a pleasure for Top 4, Dark Genix. Good having you, buddy. That was fun. Yeah. Thank you as well. All right. We get the big dog in here. Oh, baby. There he is. The big dog. Oh, baby. All right. Get in here, man. You want my spot? You can take my spot. You can take my spot. You can do whatever you want, man. How are we going to work this? <laughs> All right, there you go. There you go. First off, man, congratulations, as always. Thank you. Good to see you winning. Good job. Um, thanks, thanks. First things first, though. Biggest hurdle, feeling anything? The H-Box set? H-Box. He had you quaking, I think. Yeah, he's cracked right now. He's kind of playing incredible. I, I know he's putting in work, and he completely shifted the way he plays to like more aggro mm -hmm. and like forcing scraps. and. I like playing him right now. I think he's doing a lot of good stuff. So it that was like that was sweaty. Fun. I yeah. mean, I was having fun. That's it. Yeah. You waited to pull out the down tilt until game five. It felt like. Yeah. You held that in your pocket on the FD game. Well, what he does now is he just wave dashes around instead of right. spot dodging or crouching. Like the wave dash avoids the grab. Yeah. And it keeps him mobile and like threat. I don't know what he's gonna do. So if I max range it like. Preemptively, it's really good. With this new style that HBox plays, how do you feel about the counter picks? Is there something different you would do? Yeah, the small stages are a little scary because mm -hmm. he asked me to go back to Fountain and I said no. Good call, honestly. And then he's like, Yoshi's? And I was like, yeah, I love Yoshi's. Yeah, even right. though it could have been scary. Yeah. I mean, you three stocked him, right? On uh, game five or two stock? Something like that, something yeah. Like that was crazy. But um, yeah, I mean, kind of a, an interesting bracket for you. You ended up having to fight SFOP. Uh, after the J move double DQ. Uh -huh. uh, real unfortunate Jake couldn't make it out. Yeah. But just a, another notch in the belt at this point. Mm -hmm. I mean, Dark Genix before he left did call it a victory lap. But uh, are you are you planning on any more victory laps? Are we going to see you at any more tournaments for the year? I'm going to everything, yeah. I want to just make this a dominant end of the year because uh, I feel like I'm in the zone right now. Yeah. Uh, and I just want them to keep coming. So Miami... Actually, I'm going to show match Cody this week. Oh, mm. uh, so that should be cool. Thank you. Um, Get that on the camera so the people. Ooh, can yeah, see there you go. Cool design, yeah. Um, yeah, show match with Cody. I got Miami. I'm doing function before that, but I think I'm going to go Roy there. Okay. Uh, I want one Roy twenty a year. I think they're fun. <laughs> um, Miami into Dome Park into I don't know whatever else is there. Uh, so it should be fun. Is there anyone you're really? I mean, I know the answer to this. Who are you most excited to play out? Everyone. Yeah. 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 I got some stuff planned. Uh, okay. I've been working hard on it. Yeah. He's been your big hurdle for the year. I mean, you they've they shed that side by side where it was right. like majors with Amsa, majors that. without Amsa. It's, it's a rough stat. stat. It's a rough <laughs> stat. stat. Yeah. But I mean, if, if you're excited to play him again, I'm looking forward to what you show us. I love playing Amsa. I think even if I come up with answers and beat him, I know he's just gonna completely change the way he plays immediately. Mm -hmm. He's so dope. Uh, so yeah, I'm excited to play him. Did you put any time versus Link? Because it felt like this particular Link set. I just thought about it. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you don't need to. I played it so bad at Riptide. I was, <laughs> oh, right. dude. If you could read my mind, that said, I was an asshole. I was like, I don't even want to say. <laughs> but I literally, a after the last game, I literally just went, Shh. <laughs> like, and I was like, what's wrong with me? <laughs> but I really hate Link, and I wish he would just go Fox because I yeah. think he's a very talented player. And I think the link is just a waste of time. Yeah, that's fair. What did you think about in this set versus the last set for the, the link matchup? Uh, facing forward a lot more, um, playing really aggro in his face, like just never giving an opportunity to pull anything yeah. mm -hmm. and just like putting out hitboxes right in front of him. Uh, and then, yeah, I just didn't 
I wasn't nervous against Link. I, I went in feeling confident, and yeah, it, yeah. it was the Fox game. He was doing well. That was the thing. Uh, I feel like it was kind of odd also for the counter pick to be battlefield for Link because it it does give you like a little more space to work with. But yeah, normally, I, I feel like he reserves that died. for like for like the FD games or for like a little more. Close scramble games where he has to deal with you. But. Dude, I don't even know about the counterfeit. I think yeah. Arthur's wins everything. <laughs> <laughs> so He's I don't know. Unilateral. It was weird that was Grins. Uh, but yeah, Aqua was sick. He had a crazy run. He really uh, did. I mean, going from 17th place losers mm -hmm. all the way up to this. So he was well outside of top eight. Yeah. Because he lost to SFOP uh, one round before winners' quarters. Just pulling through the seconds. Bonkers. Crazy run. Yeah. yeah. Um, what are your thoughts about like the melee landscape in general right now? Because it feels like you're so dominant. Yeah, I mean Cody's there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, and Amsa, yeah, is just the thorn in my side right now. Mango, he's playing good when I play him in friendlies, but obviously, I'm not gonna mention what happened in Waterloo, but uh, I think I just did. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I know he'll be back. Yeah. Um, but I think there's a nice like top four right now, solid. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. You go you go back and forth in terms of like the, the matchup spread anyway. Yeah. Yeah, which is yeah. nice. Yeah. I think Mango's got seasons. I mean you brought mm -hmm. this point up earlier, but did you know that you just reached sixteen major wins tying with Ken? I did not know. Yeah. So yeah. Red Marth's neck and neck. I mean you know. Is that counting point. online or no? Uh, I don't I doubt, think I doubt so. it counts online. Yeah. It's only online or Dude, you... <laughs> <laughs> you, you all right, 16.5. Yeah. 0. 0.5 is that all that was? Oh, Point seven, point seven, point seven. Point seven. Right, point seven. I'll, <laughs> point seven. I'll take point seven for that. Oh, man. You and, you and Ed both said the same thing, where it was like, there's no ranking. <laughs> Ed was, like, was cooking online. Dude, Ed was cooking. He was so good. We had, he had nothing else oh, yeah. to do. He just yeah. played Melee. He just played, he just played unranked and just swagged. It was so sick. Yeah. Uh, all right, you got anything you want to say to the people? Uh, shout outs uh, to Moist and uh, Mogul Moves. Uh, I should be, yeah, I don't know if I want to see Lud this weekend or this week for nouns, but um, yeah, this was for them, uh, Charlie and Lud. Uh, also for Caitlin watching uh, back in Michigan. Uh, yeah, that's it for me. Hey, man. Good stuff. Thank Good you. to see you playing. and. Uh, I guess that's been it from us here at Wavelength 2024. Mm -hmm. Vish, always a pleasure commentating. You get the Bless. left hand. Oh, nice. oh, nice. All right, gentlemen. Uh, oh, it's been a pleasure. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 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 Doctor, doctor. Um, good stuff, everybody. Thanks for joining us, and have a wonderful night. <laughs>